Black and white are some of the hardest colors to paint. White because it is hard to highlight, and black because it is hard to get depth. But you can cheat both. The simplest way to paint black or white is, often, to simply not to. With black I like to use different blacks for different effects. Vallejo's black gives a very matte finish, making it perfect for armor. You can then dry brush it or highlight as desired. To add depth to black I like to cheat, by shading in a red-brown color such as Vallejo Hull Red, or Doom Ball Brown. Create a wash mix of roughly two parts water to one part paint, wipe off the excess and push the paint into the recesses. You can see the effect it gives here. For things such as cables in power armor, if the armor is also black, I like to use a gloss black, using the same mix, to shade only this time as a wash. The wash dulls down the gloss effect but not completely, leaving a subtle change of tone between the armor and the cables. For black clothing or hair you can start, by painting a dark gray color, such as Vallejo dark gray or German gray, adding any highlights or dry brushes, and then washing or shading with a black wash. Adding more shades to a given area, if you want to increase the depth. You could use a similar method for armor, perhaps with a contrast or speed paint over the top of a dark gray, but you'd have to experiment. Black leather is also fairly easy. Paint black, then highlight a dark brown, followed by a lighter brown or beige color. I like to add irregular patterns and shapes to give the leather a rough look. Then glaze the area in Vallejo smoke in roughly a 3 or 4 to 1 ratio of water to paint. The glaze ties in the colors together. Vallejo smoke is an essential paint for me, mostly for glazing leather or adding an oily look to pistons, or a burned look to weapon barrels. I couldn't recommend it enough. There are of course many other ways to paint black, such as adding or painting on dark blue tones, but the methods I've outlined here are my go-to for most tabletop quality miniatures. I would always recommend products like sets available from Vallejo, Scale 75 and Andrea Color. Not only do they contain everything you need for a given color, but they come with very handy guides to follow, giving you a great starting point, or perhaps teaching you something new dependent on your level and experience. That concludes our look at a few methods of painting black. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe and comment for more painting content. I exist to serve.